Have you been trying to find a way to keep your dog food fresh? Try to make sure that no bugs or anything gets in that valuable food that we talk about getting on a daily basis. Well, on this video, we're gonna talk about what's the best way to keep your dog food fresh. But first, if this is your first time watching, please go ahead, smash that subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the little bell for notifications. And please go ahead, feel free to follow me on my Instagram page, at Adam Your Dog Trainer, where I post pictures of my students on a very daily basis, because I'm kind of addicted to it. And you guys can go ahead and tag me and ask me questions there directly if you would like to. Alrighty, so today let's get to the video. I'll see you guys after the intro. Deuces! All right, so this video was actually a suggested video by Adgo, and what they wanted to know was how do you keep your dog food fresh? Well, I live in Florida, and the humidity here is ungodly during the summertime, and it's still warm in the wintertime. So you really gotta keep your food fresh and free of mold, and free of all those things that can get in it. So what I tend to do is I use a Vitavolt, and what they are is they're a spinnable, lockable, container that comes in all different sizes and they're actually really great for organizing your food because when I had the dogs and the cats I was able to have one for one for all for the dog food and one for the cat food and it kept it stacked and it was really convenient and yeah I mean it's pretty it's pretty no-brainer they are rather expensive they're about 30 to 40 dollars depending on the size um, they go all the way up to like 60 dollars if you get the super sized one but you know what, at the end of the day, I only have ha I've only bought in two in all the years I've had pets. So I've had the one that I've had for my dogs, I've had for almost 25 years now, and I actually use that now for my cat food. Um, and then there's another one that I have for my other cat food, uh, for m the prescription food I had to give to one of the cats when he was on a prescription. So, you know, they're really user friendly, they're easy to keep clean, they're, you know, they keep all the bugs out. Because, you know, as I said, we live in Florida here and there's tons of bugs. And it's a great way to just kind of keep everything fresh. <clears throat> now remember, when you're using an open top system like that, you are going to, you know, the food's gonna break down pretty quick because there's a lot of air getting to it. So that is one thing you wanna be aware of. Don't get a bag size that's just able to fit inside those. You wanna get the size up from the bag size that you're using. So this way it's, it keeps everything a little bit fresher. All right, and that's, that's about it. It's pretty simple. Um, you can find these at your local Petco and PetSmarts and all those local places, but there's some basic rules you wanna, you wanna get. You wanna make sure it has a lockable top. You do also wanna make sure it has a rubber gasket inside that keeps the food fresh. So this way no bugs can get in. And lastly, and probably most importantly, make sure it fits in your household some way or another, in a closet or in a cabinet. This way you can easily access the food so it's not an inconvenience, which will then make you more frustrated than not. All right, so that was a quick review of what I use to keep my dog food fresh. That was a great suggestion by Adgo. And um, if you guys have any other suggestions, please go ahead, leave it in the comments below, and I'll be more than happy to shoot a video for you if needed. All right, guys, everyone have a great week. Happy Wednesday, and I'll see you guys later. Deuces.